everyone, this is Chef DHC. Today I got another cooking video for you guys. And this is going to be episode 4. We're going to do bacon wrap hot dogs and we're going to do it LA street style. So in today's um, cast of ingredients, we got ourselves some um, bacon wrap hot dogs, either at regular and spicy. We also got our chopped um, veggies, our red, yellow, and green um, bell peppers and, some, and a white onion. We also got our French bread rolls and... The reason why I got French bread rolls because um basically you know I could do it with a regular hot dog but when it comes to holding all the veggies and everything on top I think the French bread rolls are a great choice you know and if you guys want to go with the regular hot dog ones that's on you and also I got some ketchup some mustard and some mayo so other than that there's that's our cast ingredients and I'll see you guys at the grill Alrighty then, so here we are at my uh, next to a flat top griddle and the first thing we're gonna do is let's put the hot dogs on first. So let's put put the bacon wrap hot dogs to cook first. And it's already spread with oil and I think we should be fine. Alright, let's, let's keep putting all of it. We're gonna put five of these for now on. Alright, that should be good. Let's go ahead and line it up first because we want to set them in a nice, uh, good um, place for them. Make some room for the um, for the veggies right now. There you go. That's better. So now that we got the hot dogs cooked, we'll go ahead and um, put our veggies. You guys see here? Let's put the veggies right on the grill. You guys are very familiar with the way I did this. If you guys see my um. Shrimp fajita video, uh, it's kind of similar to what I did just now. But it also works with hot dogs too. Uh, let's take our spatulas and go ahead and um, and just pretty much cook them through there. But you don't need no, uh, any, um, you don't really need no big garlic this time. That's just for the shrimp. Let's put a little bit more oil in the middle so the, so the veggies can start cooking. All right, so I added extra hot dogs because I'm cooking this for the family. And we'll take out the regular hot dogs. Yeah, we're gonna turn them up for a bit. So let's go ahead and move the hot dogs for a little bit. Man, with these two cooking right now, it gives you that vibe that you're in Los Angeles. To my friends in Los Angeles, you guys know how it is. I already flipped all these hot dogs. Except for the ones I just barely put in. We're gonna leave those from now on. Or we get the hot dogs and the veg, the peppers on cooked up right now. Uh, let's check out how how the hot dogs are. All right, th these are kind of started cooking throughout. Let's kind of move them for a little bit. Uh, let me move this one real quick. I should use the tongs for this one, but the spatula can do. And if you try to fully flip it, you guys grab the tongs. And let's and our vegetables are still cooking at the moment. Man, it really smells good. Like I said, give you that bite that you're in LA. It's kind of the same way when you guys um, go out to an event after the end, you see these little hot dog vendors. Yeah, it's giving me that same vibe too, because um, I see those hot dog vendors once in a while when I go to events in the city, so. Now we're just going to let these cook for now on. Maybe perhaps we'll check out the hot dogs tomorrow while I'm getting them burnt. Look at this, they're actually coming out good right now. Alright, let's check out hot dogs right now. Let's see how they're coming. They're coming out good right now. Let's check on both sides. Alright, sorry, I am not supposed to touch that with my hand. I have to do it with the tongs. Because these are brand new tongs that I, just, I haven't used in years. So it's my first time using these. Don't mind that. The hot dog towers are coming out good right now. Now check over to the veggies real quick. Alright, here's the veggies real quick. Let's mix them up. My god, they're actually coming out good. And actually they're cooking better than they, when I did with the shrimp fajitas and the Philly cheese sandwich. Let's go ahead and mix these up. Ooh, man. That smell of the smell of peppers and onions cooking. Very satisfying. Just like last time. 
just give me that feeling when you're in LA. Alright, so okay, we're looking at the veggies. They're pretty much almost done. Just need to get the rest of these onions pretty much cooked up. And afterwards, we're gonna pick this up real quick. So we're just waiting for these um, onions to be cooked. As for the hot dogs, some are almost ready, some just need a long way done. We're gonna put these more to the center. Oh, uh oh, that's not good. We're gonna work with that. Don't worry about it, I'll fix that in a bit. Alright, so we got some hot dogs on that pretty much done already. This one looks good. Let's go ahead and store these over here on the container. Oh yeah. Nice and cooked, the way I like it. You know, it's like a little burnt, but it should be no... It's, it's still good though. There's no problem with that. You know, some of these hot dogs are still have to be flipped. Like this one over here. So I guess the ones that are not fully cooked, we're going to put right more in the center. Um, this one... You can say it's cooked, but I think it needs more time. I think this one's done already. Now I get a little bit more time. This one's pretty, a little bit more time. Alright then, looks like our veggies are almost done, so we're all about to plate those up in a bit. Alright, this dog is done, and I believe this one too. No, no, let's, let's keep flipping them. Oh, one thing I forgot to mention, uh, I forgot the jalapenos. Because you know jalapenos are part of the LA Street hot dogs. I totally forgot about that, but I think it's just my own recipe for now. But you guys are welcome to put your jalapenos on your own hot dogs. So, let's go ahead, the veggies are done, let's go ahead and put them on the container. They came out real good. And way better than I did last time. Now the hot dogs is about to be ready and we'll pick these up. It looks like the hot dogs are perfectly done now. Now what we're gonna do is pick these up and I'll see you guys at the kitchen. Alrighty folks, so here are my, my bacon wrap um, LA Street style hot dogs. So um, top it up with mustard, ketchup, and mayo. So other than that, Enough of me talking, I'm about to get that bite. Let me grab a hot dog, see how it's good. Mmm. Wow. That hot dog is amazing. The best the vegetables tasted really good right there. And the and the hot dog itself was very nice and tender too. So other than that, um, I believe we're going to wrap this up here. So um, ladies and gentlemen, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give a thumbs up. If you're new here, might subscribe. This is episode four of my cookie series, Bacon Wrap Hot Dogs. So as always, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. And welcome to the DAC Network. This is Chef DAC signing out.